Ireland appears to be panicking at the prospect of a Brexit trade war, as Dublin draws up contingency plans while relations between the UK and EU worsen. Leo Varadkar, Ireland's Deputy Prime Minister, said they had started preparing for the results of the UK triggering Article 16 and a potential trade war between London and Brussels. It comes as the EU waits for Lord Frost's decision on if and how the UK government will trigger Article 16. The bloc has promised to match the UK scale of the action. That, Mr. Varadkar said, would likely amount to the EU suspending the trade deal struck by Lord Frost last December which, in effect, would undo the entire Brexit deal. It echoes the words of Irish Foreign Minister Simon Coveney, who last week said, one is contingent on the other, if one is being set aside, there is a danger that the other will also be set aside by the EU. Mr. Varadkar, who as Taoiseach negotiated the Northern Ireland Protocol with Boris Johnson in October 2019, told RTE News at 1, if Britain were to act in such a way that it was resigning from the protocol, resigning from the withdrawal agreement, I think the European Union would have no option other than to introduce what we call rebalancing measures to respond. I really hope that Britain doesn't go down this road. Prime Minister Johnson always spoke about wanting Brexit done. Brexit is kind of done, but this potentially undoes it and I don't think it would be good for us, for Great Britain, and I don't see how it would be good for Northern Ireland. Three weeks into talks between the EU and the UK over the protocol, which left Northern Ireland inside the EU's customs union and single market despite Britain's departure, the Deputy Prime Minister warned nobody is yet putting forward a preferable alternative. The protocol aimed, on the one hand, to avoid a land border on the island of Ireland, on the other, to protect the 1998 Good Friday Agreement.